Our company will comprise a set of unique businesses, uh, roughly $74 billion in revenue, 140,000 people around the world, the essential infrastructure company combining Dell, EMC, VMware, VirtuStream, RSA, Pivotal, SecureWorks. We have a very broad portfolio of solutions. And as the world is being instrumented, you know, we've all talked about the Internet of Things and the digital transformation, the cost of making things intelligent is approaching zero. And so the number of intelligent things is exploding. And so there's new infrastructure required and new software, new capabilities required to power that digital future. And that's really what our company is going to enable and do it securely, too. You know, Michael, normally I'd ask you about the street's reaction to such things, but because you're taking this company private, there is no street reaction. So let me go back to some of the initial media criticism of some of this. When, when this was uh, announced back in October of last year, you got criticism from Fortune, which said a, a Dell EMC deal doesn't make sense. They say if you throw two bricks together, will they float? You also had uh, Wired weighing in and saying that not just Dell, but HP, Cisco, IBM, all of these companies they think are the walking dead. What's your response to some of that criticism, and, and, and how do you combat that? You know, when we took Dell private in 2013, we had the benefit of being able to focus not on the 90-day shot clock that public companies typically find themselves in, but in a longer-term time horizon. And during that period, we've gained share for 14 quarters in a row. Mm -hmm. We've paid down substantial amounts of debt, our, our, our net debt uh, in the Dell transaction uh, as, of, as of now is, is roughly less than zero. <laughs> and when you look at the combined cash flows of Dell, EMC, VMware, well, this is a very large transaction. You find that we are operating the company with an investment grade uh, approach. And the demand for the debt has been extraordinarily high because of the high quality nature of the assets and the strong predictable cash flows, which are uh, certainly very evident uh, in our latest quarter, which uh, you can see in our, in, our, in our quarterly filings. The combined cash flows uh, of the company are uh, quite substantial, you know, on, on, on the order of $3.5 billion in, just in the last quarter. So you miss the public markets and you miss the quarterly analyst calls? Well, we actually have two public companies as part of the group. VMware, right. as you right. know, remains a public company, and SecureWorks is also a public company. And it's possible in the future that within the group we could have other public companies. Hey, CNBC fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Here you're going to find videos packed with all of the information that you need to be smarter about your finances. You can subscribe by clicking right here and click on all the videos around me or the I right here to watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.